Caitlin from The Bejeweled Life. I am so excited to be making my first ever grocery haul from one of my favorite spots, Aldi's. I've never done one of these before, but if you follow me on Instagram at The Bejeweled Life, you know that I'm always posting finds from my favorite stores and I get so many questions about my favorite things from Aldi's. So let me show you what I got. Um, I picked up these bar mop towels today. They're on sale for $3.99, I think. Also, Charlie started school with jewels and he needs a crib sheet, and this was $7. Um, I got myself one of these little pill pods for all the supplements I'm taking right now. This was $2.99. I love this coffee, it's on sale. I also have a Keurig for lazy mornings, and I always get these pods. I think they're $3.99 a box. Um, which is cheaper than anywhere I found for organic coffee. I also got my kids this block set. This was $12. Back to food. I always get the baby spinach or arugula. This one's mixed. Um, I make salads with these and smoothies and I actually am gonna try um, some arugula popsicle recipes I saw on Goop. Spring mix. If you cook grain free or you make energy balls, you know that dates are all the rage. They have these dates now at Aldi's for like $3 less than anywhere else. My husband, he's not grain free and he loves the sprouted bread. He takes sandwiches to work every single day. Right now at Aldi's they have organic grapes, which is huge. You just have to make sure that you eat them in the first couple days you get them because they will go bad for you. I always get cuties for my kids. The great thing about cuties is because they have a skin on them, they don't really need to be organic. It's not as important. Um, organic apples. They have organic bananas, but I just got the regular ones today. Same thing with the skin, I'm not as worried about organic. I love the organic rainbow carrots. I got blackberries and strawberries. These are not organic. You usually cannot find organic berries at Aldi's, but also right now, you can't find them anywhere for inexpensive. So this will just have to do this month. I got some cheese. I get my kids the organic string cheese. They love this. And feta. And then this white cheddar, I love. It's $2.99. Um, if you were to buy something comparable, it, it would probably be like $5.49 or more. So I really like this. My husband has an orange juice addiction, although I try to talk him out of it. So I got him some orange juice. We are gonna make a little snack craft with ice cream cones. So I got my kids this. If you're a LaCroix junkie, or LaCroix, however you say it, you will love this. These are like $1.39 for 12 cans of sparkling water. I like the lime the best, but they have like four flavors. Recently, all these got organic uh, cage-free eggs. These are $3.49 a box, which is a really good price for eggs. If you cook paleo, you know how important it is to have pure maple syrup. This is $6.79, which I think is pretty comparable, probably a little bit less than elsewhere. Organic mac and cheese. This is comparable to like Annie's. My kids love it and I let them have it. I think it's like $1.20 a box. I always get chicken broth or chicken stock from Aldi's. It's certified organic. I know it's less than $2 a box and if I try to go get it somewhere else, it's like $4 a box. I love their tomato basil and I believe this is under $2 too, which is crazy awesome price if you want to make pasta or pizza. I use this a lot. My kids and my husband love penne noodles. I like the quinoa brown rice. I usually make these in olive oil and add salt and they they can't even tell they're not the real thing. So if you have not tried the Never Any brand from Aldi's, it is awesome. It's not grass fed, it's not organic, but it is made without antibiotics and hormones. And my family loves it. And there's such minimal ingredients that you can really feel good about giving it to your family. And I really love all their products.
I got their breakfast sausage. I got their ham. I really like their ham because there's no carrageenan in it. Their turkey, it does have it. But this is basically comparable to like an Applegate turkey. And my husband loves it, so whatever. I'm also trying the Never Any bacon. And I'm making prosciutto wrapped asparagus for a party I'm going to. This is like $3 cheaper per box from Aldi's. I love all these lightly salted. If you get their regular salted, there's soybean oil in it, which I don't like, but they're lightly salted as um, peanut oil. Better to get raw nuts, but I like them roasted. If you haven't tried all these grass-fed beef, for real, amazing. This is like the best kept secret, except now everyone's finding out about it because when I go to all these, there's like never any left. I have to have them get me some from the back. Simply Nature pumpkin flax granola. My husband is also obsessed with this granola and um, they have organic whole milk yogurt now at all these and my kids will have that with this granola and stevia sometimes in their yogurt, the plain yogurt for breakfast. I always get my kids the gluten-free pretzel sticks. They're delicious and they are like I think $1.79 a bag, which if you're buying your kids gluten-free snacks, this is crazy good price. We also get the kettle chips from all these. These are $1.29 a bag, I believe, too. Something ridiculous where if you would get kettle chips at a, ch a different chain grocery store or a small grocery store, it's going to be like $3.49 minimum a bag. So that's all. Chocolate chips. Nothing healthy about these, but you know what? They're $1.29 and my family loves chocolate chip cookies and if I'm making a healthy version of chocolate chip cookies, I'm not too worried about having these in there. The other thing is, I have a two-year-old who is not potty trained yet and I am still doing diapers. I used to order super expensive diapers um, from a subscription service that you probably all know about and I love the patterns but honestly I am probably saving like 50 to 60 dollars a month since switching to all these diapers and wipes and I'm able to use that 50 or 60 dollars a month to buy more healthy food for my family my son has never gotten a diaper rash and I just like, love their diapers I think they're awesome I highly recommend them also my children love to brush their teeth and then brush other things in the house with it. So I always get toothbrushes from all these. This is $1.29 for two and I probably throw them away every week just by how dirty they all get. So anyways, that is my haul for today. I'll use my grass fed beef for dinners, tacos and burgers. I'll do macaroni for my kids one night. I'll use the never any sausages for dinner. I'll be able to make a salad. And I'll probably just have to supplement with some organic vegetables from the farmer's market. I'll make them um, muscatoli one night. So I have like four dinners here and food for lunches and snacks. If you go to the grocery store as much as I do, you know that is huge. Okay, so that is my Aldi's haul. Hopefully if you've been avoiding Aldi's, you're inspired to try it now. You can get some really healthy options there. And let me know what you think of this video and also let me know what you find at Aldi's or what your favorite things are. I can't wait to watch all the Aldi haul videos on here. Thanks for watching.